The story of Mark and Debbie Constantino is a very tragic yet all too common one of domestic violence. What made this story different was its association with paranormal activity. Mark and Debbie were quasi-celebrities in the paranormal field. They often appeared on the Travel Channel and Discovery Plus popular long-running paranormal series Ghost Adventures. Ghost Adventures is a show that follows the crew of a paranormal investigation team as they explore various allegedly haunted locations, hoping to collect visual or auditory evidence of paranormal activity. The series is popular for its outlandish and often ridiculous claims, but it's also well known for being one of the most genuinely scary shows on television. The show's stars are Zach Bagans, Aaron Goodwin, Billy Tolly, and Jay Wasley. Each episode begins with the crew touring the investigation site with its owners or caretakers. The Constantinos frequently appeared on reality shows about the supernatural, claiming to be knowledgeable about this subject area. The Constantinos billed themselves as experts in electronic voice phenomena, EVPs, and made a lot of appearances on reality shows about the supernatural. Most notably, recurring on Travel Channel's Ghost Adventures. So what happened to Mark and Debbie from Ghost Adventures? Paranormal investigators Mark and Debbie Constantino, and a third man were killed in Sparks, Nevada when a domestic violence incident turned deadly. The couple was estranged, and Debbie Constantino had been living with two roommates. The police were called to her apartment after one of her roommates found their male roommate dead and Debbie missing. Police eventually discovered that the woman was being held hostage by Mark Constantino in an apartment belonging to one of the couple's adult children. After officers knocked on the apartment door, they reported hearing gunshots inside and heard a male voice tell them to keep their distance. He asked for 15 minutes with his wife, threatening to shoot her if the police did not comply. Police said they tried to negotiate with the man before finally blowing open the door with explosives. Unfortunately, the negotiations to secure Mark Constantino's surrender failed and, as a result, Mark and Debbie were found dead by the SWAT team when they breached the apartment door around 1.30 p.m. The SWAT team was unable to prevent Mark from killing Debbie, then turning the gun on himself and committing suicide. The couple's daughter was not on the premises during the standoff. There were reports that the Constantinos had numerous run-ins with local law enforcement due to complaints of domestic violence. Mark Constantino was charged with kidnapping, domestic battery by strangulation, and domestic battery against Debbie. Of course, due to their connection with the paranormal, there were all types of rumors going around about Mark possibly being possessed by an evil demon. It is our speculation that this had nothing to do with demonic possession, but more to do with Mark's personal demons and choices.